Hi, my Capricorns. It's Jamie Zebra 23. I am doing your weekly spread for Capricorn Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Cross Watchers. I'm on all social media. It's Jamie Zebra 23. If you'd like a personal reading, check out the description box. Um, my readings are 20 minutes, 40 minutes, and 60 minutes. I typically do your readings within 24 to 72 hours. I also have a new feature, same day readings. It's a little pricier, but you do get your readings the same day. I also have an $8 one question, one answer via email only. Um, I typically answer your questions within 20 minutes. Uh, please email me after you've made a purchase so that I can hurry up and answer you. Um, I also have three different payment methods that you guys can use. I've got Google Wallet, I've got Cash App, and I also have um, the Facebook GoFundMe. Um, I just want to let you guys know now so that you can click off if you choose. There is a cartoons on. I do have children in the room, so there may be giggling, there may be shrieking, there may be fighting over toys. If you can't handle that, Click off to another channel. Uh, sorry, I'm not going to get a babysitter so that I can do your readings. Free reading. Sorry, not going to happen. Okay, guys. So this is what we've got going on. For my Capricorn, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Cross Watchers. This looks good. Capricorn, it's a good reading. It's a good one. Nine of Cups. Ace of Cups. The Judgment card. The Page of Swords. The Ten of Wands. So, it looks like you guys uh, are finding love with a, with a water sign. A Cancer, Pisces, or a Scorpio. We've got the Ace of Cups here. Thank you. Thank you. Um, the kids are wearing my fiance's hats. <laughs> um, but anyway, so it looks like Capricorn, you're going to be finding love with a water sign, with a Cancer, a Pisces, or a Scorpio person. Um, it's going to work. I feel like it's karmically connected, but in a good you know, karmics are lessons, but I feel like this karmic relationship could actually turn into a real soulmate situation. And then we got the judgment card here. So it's like you guys are paying off, paying back debts. You've already paid it. I feel like Capricorn, you guys have, you guys have had to pay back some heavy shit. You guys paid your debt. Good for you. It's been a long road for Capricorn. Okay. Judgment. So don't create any more debt because it's been a fucking doozy, hasn't it? Hope you guys learned. Okay, Page of Swords is here and then the Ten of Wands. So some of you guys have a fire sign that's pissed off because you are finding love with a uh, with a water sign. They're pissed off because it, you're definitely finding love with a with a water sign. This could be their, their moon or their rising as well. Um, I do see here with the Ten of Wands that there's going to be a fire sign that's going to try to punish you either spiritually, mentally, emotionally. Somebody might be trying to use your kid against you. Um... Yeah, somebody's somebody's trying somebody's just trying to look to see what they can do. See how they got that sword and they're looking behind them and try they're like case in the joint, looking like lurking. What can I do to hurt this person? How can I stop their happiness? What can I do to harm them? How can I hinder? That's their problem, not yours, Capricorn. Let those haters hate. I feel like you got nothing to worry about. Especially Capricorn women here. You guys have you guys have learned your lessons. You got nothing to worry about. Also, there's a lot of Capricorns that I feel I'm picking up that feel like they're bad parents or they have been bad parents and they feel a lot of guilt. Don't play. Things happen, guys. I feel like for the most part, you guys did what you could at the time. You did your very, very best. But the thing is, is that it is what it is. You know better now, so you do better now. Some of you have opportunities to raise babies and you want to raise them differently than you did before. Capricorn, you got this. Don't worry. You're going to do better. All you can do is do better. Your people are resilient. So your children may have been through a lot, especially if you have children that are like between, between eight years apart and 12 years apart. This new baby, and there may be even another baby coming, a new baby coming. I feel like some of you just had a baby, and then there's another baby coming. You'll, you'll do fine. Okay, so as far as finances go, finances are looking really good for you guys. I feel like you could be proud of yourselves. The crops are definitely coming in. There's new business opportunities coming. I feel like you guys have lived and learned. Some of you started spending your money and blowing your money on things that you shouldn't, but it's showing here that it's it'll work out just fine. Everything is fine. Also, I feel like for a lot of you, um, with the judgment card, you are using your judgment. That's why history will not repeat itself because you guys are taking a positive stance. Also, just be aware of stalkers. If you guys are doing something illegal, not like you can't knock it off if that's your sole way of making income, keep in mind that you're being watched by law enforcement. You are. Some of you know that you're being watched by law enforcement. Try not to piss anybody off so they don't call law enforcement on you. How about you do that? 
Don't make any en Capricorn, stop making enemies. Just stop making enemies. It's not going to work in your favor. Try to make nice with everybody. Anybody you did piss, piss off, you know, you can say, please, God, please, angels, please, I'm sorry for pissing those people off. Please, please have that message get to them so that, so that the karmic debt can be cleared. All right, guys, ta-ta for now.